What if I told you that humanity just captured the clearest image of a visitor from another star system, a ghostly traveler, carrying secrets from the dawn of creation? This isn't science fiction. This is the James Webb Space Telescope reshaping our understanding of the cosmos. For as long as humans have existed, we've stared at the stars with wonder, asking the same timeless questions. Where do we come from? Are we alone? What else is out there? With the James Webb Space Telescope, the most advanced eye we've ever placed in the heavens, we now stand at the edge of answering them. Unlike Hubble, which revealed the universe in visible and ultraviolet light, Webb peers into the cosmos with infrared vision, allowing it to uncover what was once invisible light from the very first galaxies, hidden star nurseries, and even planets orbiting distant suns. But then, something extraordinary happened. From deep space, an interstellar comet, cataloged as 3I Atlas, crossed our solar system, and Webb's powerful gaze locked onto it. What it revealed stunned scientists worldwide. 3I Atlas is no ordinary cometides, only the third interstellar object humanity has ever detected. Unlike the countless icy wanderers born within our solar system, this one hails from another star, carrying with it the chemical history of a world far from our own. For astronomers, it was like receiving a time capsule from another neighborhood in the galaxy. The challenge was immense. The comet was faint, moving at over 100,000 miles per hour, while Webb itself orbits a million miles away from Earth. Yet, through precision tracking and incredible engineering, Webb's sensors locked onto this fast-moving traveler. A series of exposures were captured, data flowed back as raw code, and after painstaking processing, the first image appeared. Scientists gasped. The universe had just given us a message, and Webb had read it. The picture was breathtaking. At the center sat the comet's nucleus, sharp and detailed, showing ridges, craters, and alien textures sculpted by eons of cosmic radiation and collisions. Surrounding it, a glowing halo of gas and dust burst outward, with shimmering jets streaming like geysers into space. Webb's infrared detectors even identified water vapor, carbon dioxide, and an unusually high abundance of carbon monoxide suggesting. This comet formed in a region far colder than where our own comets were born. This wasn't just a rock of ice and dust. It was chemistry in motion, a recipe for life itself. Within its plumes were complex organics, the same building blocks that may have once seeded life on Earth. Suddenly, the idea that comets carry life's ingredients across the galaxy wasn't just theory it, was unfolding before our eyes. Each pixel of Webb's image told a story an ancient tale written in light, carried across unfathomable distances before finally being captured by the golden mirror of humanity's most powerful telescope. At first glance, the comet appeared small, almost fragile against the vast darkness of space. But Webb's unmatched sensitivity revealed an astonishing complexity hidden within. Every detail, every jet of gas, every grain of dust was a fragment of history, a record of processes that had unfolded long before our sun was even born. The jets erupting from the comet's icy surface were not random bursts of material. They were signatures of motion, tracing the comet's spin as it tumbled. Across interstellar space, each plume acted like a cosmic clock hand, allowing astronomers to calculate its rotation, map its surface activity, and even identify patches where sunlight had ignited dormant ice for the first time in millions of years. Two scientists, these jets were more than dramatic visuals. They were windows into the comet's inner structure, exposing where it was active, where it was silent, and how it responded to the warmth of our star. Stretching outward from the nucleus were colossal dust tails, streaming for millions of kilometers like glowing ribbons across the cosmic canvas. These tails carried with them delicate grains of material, tiny fragments chipped away from the comet's body by the forces of solar radiation and wind. Yet within this dust was treasure clues about its birthplace, its chemical environment, and the unique conditions of the star system it once called home. For astronomers, analyzing the dust tail was like performing a cosmic autopsy peeling back layers of history to reveal the story of formation. Asterisk, but what truly elevated Webb's. Observations was its ability to see beyond what human eyes could detect. Unlike Hubble, which captured light in visible and ultraviolet wavelengths, Webb observed the comet in infrared. This meant every color in its image wasn't just aesthetic, it was science. Each wavelength revealed a specific molecule or element. Blues, reds, and golds weren't just artistic flourishes, they were fingerprints of alien chemistry in those colors. Scientists found the unmistakable signals of water vapor, carbon dioxide, and carbon monoxide. Water told the story of icy reservoirs scattered throughout the universe, 
suggesting that our solar system is not unique in holding the essential ingredient for life. Carbon dioxide and carbon monoxide, on the other hand, revealed something far. Stranger, their unusually high abundance hinted that this comet originated in an incredibly cold region. Perhaps a place far more distant from its parent star than where our own comets were formed. This discovery immediately challenged assumptions, suggesting that star systems across the galaxy may forge comets under wildly different conditions. And within those same jets and dust clouds were traces of complex organic molecules, the raw, ingredients for life itself. To think that a comet born in a star system light years away carries the same chemistry capable of sparking biology on Earth was breathtaking. It suggested that life's recipe may not be unique to our world at all. Instead, it may be written into the very fabric of cosmic evolution scattered like seeds across galaxies by comets just like 3 Eye Atlas. Comparing this alien traveler with comets in our own solar system gave scientists something they had never had before, a second data point. For decades, astronomers have studied our native comets, learning how they form, break apart, interact with the sun. But having only one solar system to study limited their perspective. Webb's glimpse of 3 Eye Atlas changed that. Hey now, scientists could compare to entirely different star systems and see how their comets evolved under different conditions. What they found was both familiar and surprising. In many ways, 3i, Atlas, resembled the comets we know as E, dusty, volatile when warmed by starlight. Yet in its chemistry and behavior, it carried hints of an entirely different evolutionary path. This meant that planet formation the emergence of oceans, and even the spark of life might not follow a single universal template. Instead, each star system may tell its own version of the story. Guided by local conditions, temperatures, and materials, the implications were staggering. If life's building blocks exist in multiple star systems, then the universe may be filled with worlds rich in possibility. Some planets may be barren and frozen, while others may harbor oceans teeming with activity, and perhaps, just perhaps, a few may hold civilizations gazing at their own skies. It's asking the same questions we do. Every pixel of Webb's image became a clue in this grand investigation. What began as a faint blur of light moving across the heavens was transformed into a scientific treasure trove. So, as we stand at the dawn of this new era, one truth is clear. The best discoveries are still ahead of us. Asterisk.